Oh, okay. What the fuck? Oh, oh. who the fuck? What? What the fuck, man? Hey guys, Cranky Kaz here. And the Sherpster. We're here with a new Let's Play series. We're going to be playing The Quarry. We played through Until Dawn and loved it. Let's see how many people we kill this time. <laughs> uh, I agree to all. Probably just sign my life away. I love this opening music. It's really cool. Yes. We just say it sounds like old 90s horror yeah. sort of music, so, doesn't it? What is all this stuff that we've got going on? Movie mode, watch from a selection What's of predefined. <gasps> yes, let's do couch co op. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, hang on. Settings. Let's just check that we have subtitles on. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I didn't even know that this uh, had couch co op. That is really cool. Let's do it. Okay, add player. No. No. Back. God, this is like Man of Medan all over again, isn't it? <laughs> well, I'm trying to work out how to work this out. Yeah. So these are the characters. It. Okay, Laura. Bags packed and ready for adventure. Laura helps her boyfriend Max navigate the route to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. She's about to find out there's a lot more to lose than her bearings on the map. Jacob plays the fool, and whether it's intentional or not, it usually gets a laugh. When the laughter stops and the lights go out, the one thing he can see is the mistakes he's made. Whether or not he fixes them is up to you. Okay. Abigail, creative, expressive, unsure of what she really wants, Abby is happy just following along. But as darkness falls, she's about to learn her own choices matter more than she ever thought possible. Dylan. Dylan's dry, quick-witted sense of humour has been his default mode for the whole summer. But tonight, for maybe the first time in his life, things are about to get serious. Ryan. That looks like um, Matt's actor from Until mm -hmm. Dawn. I thought Abigail also looked Abigail like Abigail looks like... Jess. Oh. No? No, 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 okay. I don't think so. That's who I thought of initially when um, seeing that. We've now gone to Emma, but Ryan. Um, usually likes to keep himself to himself, but tonight the friends he's made at camp need him to step up, step out of his comfort zone, and step into the woods. Okay. Emma, more comfortable on camera than off. Emma's personality radiates from her like her beauty. She's got her whole life ahead of her, and she can't wait to leave this summer behind if she can just survive the night. Nick. Nick's polite and reserved demeanour have always served him well, but if he wants to survive the night, he's going to have to look a lot deeper into who he really is. Now that looks like Emily's actor. Yeah, I see where you get that from. Whether it's cars or other people's business, Caitlin likes to tinker. She knows what makes something tick, but she's about to discover that when night falls, somebody's got to roll up their sleeves and take the lead. Okay. So how do we... Yeah, just randomly assign all characters. Okay, and let's then... just do that. So... Player one. I will be player one then. I've mm -hmm. got Caitlin, Dylan, Abigail and Nick. And I've got Jacob, got... Ryan, Laura and Emma. Works for me. Does that mean I'm starting then? Player two. Damn it. Right, Ready. okay, fine. I'm starting then. Let's go. Wait, David Arquette? Ross from Friends is in this. No, that's David Schwimmer. Is it? Oh, no, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> um, Courtney Cox's husband, then. Is it? I'm just going to shut up. <laughs> you just shut up. <laughs> oh, how happy it all sounds, and it's all going to go to shit, isn't it? These camera angles are unnerving. Yep. Someone's watching you. Mm. We were saying about a summer camp at this Hackett's Quarry. I mean, what a place to hold a summer camp. Yeah, health and safety forms must be ridiculous for that shit. Is it going to be the same sort of premise as Until Dawn, where it's basically just night time the whole, the whole way through? 
I guess we will find out. Route 919. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're lost. <laughs> we're, just, we're in geographic flux. Right. So geographic flux. Lost. I love it. That's debatable. <laughs> Was not expecting this. Take a moment. It's to like Fallout. Yeah. Fun, as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are I pressed quick that time button. events. I'm on guessing I wasn't supposed to. Which will help you to act at just the right time. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball. And it could spell disaster. <laughs> the path you tread is yours to choose. But that doesn't mean there won't be obstacles along the way. Okay. Oh, heads up. Oh, right. So I thought what? that was the circle Money button. Bike. But no, it's actually the um, analog stick. Thank you. Oh, so heads up. So that was like a hold it up. That Man, press the roads up. are definitely yeah. getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right. That's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. You know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gotten lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Pick them up. Uh, voila. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, how do happen to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. No signal. Great. Of course not. And you only just noticed? Okay, let's see. So we are... Okay, so these guys are a couple then. Yeah. Well, I, I was guess trying to work out whether they were brother and sister or a couple. Have you seen any signs for it? Please look where you're hey, going. Eyes on the road. Yes. Whoa. The fuck is that? Whoa. Max. Oh my god. What the heck is that? That really looks like a circle. It does. Yes. I pressed circle again when I saw it. Where's that figure gone? Is it the left analog stick? Yes. Okay. Well, right. That's the one I've been pressing, and it's been doing stuff. I'm so gonna that's be good. doing until dawn stuff and using the right analog well, stick. Well, that was a left analog stick, but the picking yeah. between yeah. them, I used the right hand yeah. analog stick. Okay. Yeah. I don't know whether like they both work. A bear? It was not a bear. What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Oh, are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. I just realised that neither of them wearing seat belts either. They are very lucky if that's the case. What is it? I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Okay. Uh... I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again. Max is gonna my, uh, get nobbled, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, okay. He, oh no, don't, uh, no. Mm. Max isn't a character, is he? He's not one of the main ones we're playing as, no. He's getting nobbled. Right, so we can walk around using the left hand analog stick. It's not so bad. 
My mom's gonna kill me. I mean, you should have been paying attention to the road, to be honest. Tutorial unlocked. Interrupts. Press L1 to view. Well, let's just have a look, shall we? Oh. <laughs> At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves, That's giving the you the actor, chance to take matters into your own hands. It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. <laughs> In fact, sometimes... It's better not to. <laughs> I love the fact it's like done like VHS style. Mm. Are we gonna snoop? Nope. Oh, I kinda want to, there's a letter there. I know, let's go. We are trusting. Thanks, huh? Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. Here you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space either. Well, anywhere is better than here. Okay, so much for shining the lights on, you know, what he's looking at. Oh, Ooh, hello. there's a woman in a nighty. Where are you going? Just over here. No. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Um, I don't really like either of those no. things, but I think I'm just going to go with the hurry up. Yeah, compliant. Yeah. Could be like a nice way of saying hurry yeah. up. Yeah. God, Max, hurry up! Okay, no, it's not. <laughs> What's going on? I'm worried that Better there's somebody a dick down there. Towards him. Are you serious? Yeah, that, they could be hurt. I don't know. I don't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something. Okay? Where's he like, looking? A woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Luck with the car. Why are we going off on our own? Because they're silly. <sighs> Right, okay. So let's have a look around. I mean, look how, like... Yeah, I mean, look at the graphics. It just looks really good. Definitely looks like a more... Ooh. Taro found the fool. The fool, I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom, or recklessness and risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think and don't get burnt. Okay. There's 22 tarot cards by the looks of it. And we have found our first one. I can't move the camera. Oh, I can move the camera a bit. Buy tickets now. For the Harem Scarum is spectacular. What's this? Let's view it. Oh. <sighs> Missed it, sorry. You go to the menu to view it? Show text. Sli Sideshow spectacular. Fortunes and freaks, mystery and magic. Es escapologists and enigmas. Buy tickets now. Okay, wonderful. This is of a fork. If they designed it the same way as Until Dawn, where there's like a little fork, but they all ultimately take you to the same place. So obviously we had like totems in Until Dawn. Are the tarot cards yeah, like the equivalent be... or are there other things? 
She seems to be moving at a reasonable pace though, which is good. That makes me happy. I'm not entirely sure where we're getting the whole gameplay recording thing, but... We always get that when it's yeah. like... It's to do with copyright, I think. It comes up at really random times, though, sometimes. Mm. Another fork in the road. Do we want to go... Oh, this... There's a little treasure chest. I'm not sure we want to open it, but... Okay. Right, press Ooh. L1 to view. Yes, we'll look at this one, sorry. <laughs> oh, we can look at this poster now. This is a poster for a travelling sideshow. Looks like it's been here for a while. <coughs> Are those burn marks around the edges? Okay. Escapology trunk. trunk a trunk filled, filled with, with strange, strange devices. devices. A relic of a travelling show. Right? Okay, it's related to the harem scarum bud looks mm. a bit. Is that how you pronounce it, harem scarum? I have no idea. Sounds right. To me. Mainly because I'm thinking of the word scare. Yeah, well, it's not going to be harem scarum, is it? Hopefully. Harem scarum. No idea. Right, okay. Don't go too far. So we wander off into the woods. Oh, God, there's loads of ways you can go. Ooh, more stuff. What the hell? Broken cage. Doesn't look like... Oh, it looks like an animal has nested here. Okay. Oh, What's no. with the question marks underneath? That Does... must be stuff that we haven't... Because in Until Dawn, um, when I was playing it off camera recently, like mm -hmm. as you find out more information, oh, does it add more it adds underneath? More info. Ah, right. Okay, Science. that makes more sense. Dark boy. Well, that sounds wonderful. Yikes! This is too weird. It is. Right, so I've seen that. Let's go. There's never a good time to drink, is there? I'm drinking. You're not having to do anything, that's why. I mean, that's, <laughs> yeah, but I still get jump scared. Right, before I carry on walking. <sighs> Down or up? I have no idea. Just a way. Down is not a route to go. So, okay. Up then. So that woman... Silas. That old woman... Mm-hmm. I think she's the one on that poster. Oh, is she? Oh, wonderful. I mean, this is great. She's just wandering off randomly. Is she going to remember the way back to the car? I don't know, because she's walked quite away from the she car. She has. Don't go she? too far. Goes too far. Yeah. Is now lost. Phone battery is going to die. What the heck was that? Seemed like there was something there before. Okay, now now you're regretting going so far away, aren't you? Where are you? My guess? She's getting freaked out, but actually that one who was saying something is actually just Max saying where have you gone. Silence. <laughs> or not. Wait for the quick times. That sort of quick time then, fine. Pale yourself on a branch. At least it gave us a bit of a warning. Oh, he's still alive, okay, good. Hey, 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 hey. what's wrong? What's wrong? Is everything alright? Holy shit. Talk to me, what's going on? What's going on? There's something out there. Like I was there was a 
noises all around me. Honey, 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 take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave, please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Okay. Car is fixed by the looks of it, so that's good. You right? No. Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on! Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. Oh no, we're gonna get stuck. Max! I just, okay, give me a minute, give me a minute. We've got to go, Max! Right, you're not helping right now. Can you just, I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just... enough! Shit, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. Get the feeling that's not really working. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Oh! Oh! oh fuck! Oh my the god! fuck is that? Just Hi. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Take go on, then. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Path chosen. Let's have a look at this tutorial, shall we? Hackett's quarry is full of twists and turns. Unknown so it paths takes you out the mood a bit, doesn't it? Pointers. Yeah. <laughs> but I love it, though. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. There will be <laughs> moments throughout your stay that show you that the choices you've made, the path you've chosen, could have gone another way. At Hackett's quarry, love there's no such <laughs> thing as the wrong way. But be warned. Some paths are more dangerous than others. <laughs> okay, so we're now gonna get a choice. Yeah. Um... Honesty is yeah. the best policy, I feel. I agree. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and now here we are. Something jumped out I don't like you okay you're kind of creeping me out a bit it was dark uh, I'm sorry it was, it was so dark and it happened so fast and they were gone they ma'am did you hit someone the detail no, on my face is no, in this not. you know I mean I don't think so I don't, I don't know sir Path chosen. Keep the car running. Sir? No, right, it actually gives you a little Ooh. uh sort of Is this kind of like the all time scariest cop? Yeah. I don't know. This is my first cop. <laughs> what, like ever? Uh yeah, I'm not a criminal. No, I can't get over the detail on all their faces though. Yeah. Uh it's alright, let's pull this out. Okay. To winch, we've got enough experience with those in other games, right? <clears throat> Very kind of you, sir. Now, you folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night? We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out. You know, I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. <sighs> hey, look at him admitting it as well. You're not going to make it to Haggard's Quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night. Okay. What is on his neck? Uh, yeah, I, I noticed that as well. I think we're just going to well. stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am. You're going to head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Uh, right. Shall we be insistent this yeah. time? Yeah. 
With all due respect, sir, why can't we go to Hackett's Quarry? Because I told you to go to the motel. Okay, I just don't understand what the problem- Ma'am, please step out of the vehicle. Whoa. What? Why? Officer, she didn't do anything. Ma'am, if you wouldn't mind stepping out of the vehicle, I would just like to show you a route on your map there. Son, remain in the vehicle. We're pissing off the cop. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. So we. Right about it's here. All about. <laughs> Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay, and where was Hackett's quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Wow, he is not allowing us to go to Hackett's quarry. No. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Wait, but, but what if there's someone out there? Yeah, I'll have a look. Good night. Well, he seemed dodgy. What was on his neck, and why were his eyes doing funny things? And why did he lick the pencil in that way? Sometimes people lick pencils. I know, but I did, they, they sort of made it Did it in a creepy way. Yeah. Why is this guy just sitting there? Yes. Yeah. Give him mm -hmm. major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen showers. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I did you see was, that? Was it blood? No good, I noticed it as well. Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh, my God. oh man. <sighs> Alright, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night, thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here. Mm -hmm. And the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's quarry. Oh, we're gonna go, are How'd we? How'd you do that? I don't know, I kind of checked him into showing you. <laughs> Very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am? Oh my god, if he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20's... <laughs> debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kinda into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> okay, so Max is still alive. That's a good sign. Kind of surprised by that. When I'm playing as Laura. So yeah, still Laura, still sorry. Here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Oh. Oh. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? Well, it's not the best idea to sort of assume. I mean... Clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll yeah. beat the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nice one, Laura. Good start. I initially thought she was going to be the, uh, the Sam anybody equivalent. Home? But so far I'm... Not, not getting, getting Sam yeah. vibes. No, definitely not. We've just played Until Dawn. If you're new to the channel, 
So we're coming off the back of Until Dawn, so there may be quite a lot of comparisons. Yeah. Two playthroughs of Until Dawn, I might add. Where we did slightly different things. Okay, this is going well. So it has the same, like, just... I'll just move the phone around in random directions to uh, do it while she's not moving ahead at all. <clears throat> to be fair, if I was Max, I probably still wouldn't, even if I was annoyed about You'd this whole thing, with I'd stay Laura. with her. Yeah. Jump scare incoming. Oh. Or not. What the, what the heck? A very weird camera, random camera angle to... Oh. Oh, oh stuff in there. Shine oh. your torch in the I'm room. trying to, but she's signing it everywhere else. Lift it up. There we go. Anything else in here? Doesn't appear to be. Right, okay. I don't see anything to interact with apart from the door. Go back to the car then? Yeah. No, there's more stuff down here, so that's good. doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Fun. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Right. Lord, there's no one here. Come on. Just give me one more minute, okay? Can we look back there? Yeah, there's, I was going to yeah. look back there as well. I just wanted to see if there's anything here first. It's letting us walk, so that's a good sign. Door with a light on it. Uh, what? The hey. hell? It hey, could are be you a okay? dog, though. No, that wasn't a dog. It looked, is in some I'll way, right it looked back. like a dog to me. But, but then it might be, uh, yeah, something. Much that more looked unpleasant. like a person. Max, Max, get over here. What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break mm, them off. Not sure okay, about that. We're gonna get you out of there. Hey. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know, you just said tools. Why didn't you just bring... Look, there's someone in there. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone. Wait, no, look. I'm looking, I am. Let me see. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay, okay, so... What are we going to do? Oh, I don't know. Neither of those seems like a particularly good tool to use. I feel like a wrench has sort of got more than one use to it, whereas a hammer is just about walloping things. Okay. Let's take the wrenches. Doesn't the hammer have a claw on the other end, though? It does. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure. All right. Hammer time. Hammer time. Hammer time. That's making a shit ton of noise. Wow, that was super loud. Yep. <laughs> you need a hand? Yeah.
did not sign up for this. You've Max is probably thinking this. that anyway. Hello? Are you hurt? Do you exist? <laughs> Why have you dropped the hammer? I don't know, that was really... Why? Why would hey, you drop the hammer? Be careful. Oh yeah, just sit there, leave her to... Oh, honestly, these guys are fucking... Ian. Right. Bodes well. Cracked mirror. Why would you not keep the hammer? I don't know, because she's stupid, clearly. <laughs> Or it doesn't make for a, a good game. Not going to look at this? Oh yeah, we are going to look at this. Bloodied collar. Let's look at that. This bloody collar looks to be too big for a dog. What kind of dog would be called Ian anyway? <laughs> okay. I like to give pets boring male names. Like yeah, you would, Nigel. Yeah, you tried to give your <laughs> you tried to call your rabbit Nigel, didn't you? Uh, okay. Um, that is the rib cage. Max? What's gonna come and get us? Let's just keep walking. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. Anything else here that I can interact with? Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Hey, it's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... <laughs> Woo! What the fuck? Go and check it out. Uh, no, run the fuck away. Oh. Oh. Max. His blood. Help. Oh. I think I'm bleeding a lot. Shit. Help, Max. <laughs> Path chosen. What? It's a police officer, isn't it? It is. What the fuck, man? Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel to you? Um, okay. Fly me to the moon and let me play Very interesting choice of music right now. Let me know what spring is like. All I can think of is Bayonetta. Yes. In other words, hold my hand. In other words, darling, kiss me. The end. <laughs> you failed. Yeah. <laughs> well, wonderful. You all I long for, all I worship and adore. In other words, so what on earth happened to Max there? What on earth got him? The human, like, not quite human. It sounded non-human to Ian me. I think Ian got him. Ian. <laughs> 
Cause of death, Ian. <laughs> oh dear. Okay then. Based on everything that happened there, it looked like Max was dying Hello, anyway. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. We are friends, aren't we? I don't well, know. Don't know about that. <laughs> I've waited for you. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes, and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. That was the tarot card that I found. This is the card you found. Thank you for confirming that. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom. Or recklessness and risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think. And don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. Should yeah, see let's yeah. see more. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. A path yet unchosen. Look here, look here. Oh no. That doesn't look good. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Interesting. Let me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. So it sounds like they've got the same sort of thing like with the totems and until dawn yeah. but in a way it looks like if it's going to work the same way so it's still me for yep. the sake <laughs> um i was hoping to pass it across That's to you right. um but it seems to me from that i might be completely wrong here that you have the choice whether you want to see them or not yeah and you may only see them with that lady you don't see them yes so when you don't you actually see find it them. when you find them you find the card and then give it to her that's yeah. how i interpret that are you ready to play jacob um, Let's do it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Let's try and instill a nice, happy atmosphere here, despite what we've just seen. Rip Max. Oh, God. Definitely see the graphics upgrade, can't you? Mm. After playing Until Dawn. Until Dawn was definitely not bad, but this looks really, really detailed. This is the PS5 version, of course, we must have that in. Mm. So it's all happy looking and everything. And yeah, we were here last Ladies. night and saw what we saw. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, hack it's quarry forever. <laughs> okay, so all these people know each other by the looks of it. Or do they? You know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. Oh, are we going to be cynical or reflective? I don't know. I say, you never know. Mm. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me? Okay, spell it. Nothing to spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. So she dumped her ass, huh? <laughs> yeah. 
Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. I'm guessing Emma is the ex. Yeah. Excellent. So okay. they were waving kids off. So, oh, oh, no, had they been dropped off by the no, boss? No, 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 no. I think they okay. were waving the kids off. I think these guys are counsellors at the camp. Right, Bags. okay. So they're Bags. a little bit older. I see. So where are these bags? And who's this guy? We're about to find out. <clears throat> hey, what are you uh what are you listening to? Good to know. That was a completely pointless trip well, over there, wasn't it? I heard something about hay bales catching fire. Mm-hmm. Are you looking for the bags? Yeah. Because they're in the back of the car. Well, I just went over there and she, yeah, she basically told me to go and get bags and... Yeah, they're literally... it's these ones, isn't it? <sighs> Jacob, go upstairs. Oh, Jacob, get okay. Bag. Caitlin moves on with her goddamn life. Okay. Thank you. You just got me in trouble with <laughs> Kate. I'm assuming that's Caitlin. Caitlin. <laughs> oh. Alright, so we've been in here. We're gonna go and follow the bus or so. I don't fucking know. No, upstairs. Uh, what did you interact with this? Didn't we already see it? Not the as map. Jacob. Okay. What Get to see it in the daytime as well. Will make you stronger. Okay. Not in the mood, sign. Okay, so the breakup was fairly recent. Yeah, and uh, sounds like he's putting a brave face on, but underneath isn't too happy about it. Guessing it wasn't his choice. Jesus Christ. Hey. Hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's. Dylan, come it's on. It's broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's... I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just. Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. Cool. Thanks, guys. What? Why are they. I don't know, that all seems a bit weird. Nothing extra about this one by the looks of it, it's just Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp was established way back in 1953 and still going strong today, nearly 70 years on. Wonderful. Well, you get to see the water now though. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty. How nice does that look? And he's going to look at the view himself by the oh, looks man. of it. Would want to leave a place like this. It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. I mean, the whole sort of summer camp thing obviously comes across as a, a very sort of American thing. I, I must admit, the idea of it, I, I would have hated it probably as a kid. Really? Yeah, I think so. Just how I was as a kid. What was it? The going outside thing? You no, no, so much as just being with lots of being like with loads of other kids, loads of other kids, and probably like lots of like oh, skill. cool kids. You know, you know, just the idea of being surrounded by that lot, and not able to go home for ages. Don't think I'd have enjoyed it. Horror. I hate horror. Oh dear. That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate about considering what we expect to happen in this game. I mean, it's funny, it's like this sort of whole happier feeling atmosphere right now, and the fact it's daytime, we didn't get any of that in until dawn. Mm. It's a very different vibe they're going Can with. Can we look at that poster on the... Because that looks like a tutorial type, you know? It just says, shh! But it does oh, look like it's got the library. art from the, uh, the it does, same... Yeah. From, the, from the tutorials, yeah. 
door over there. Anything over here? Why don't we go? Mm. Yeah, I'm going to go through that door. I wanted to see if there's anything in here first. Feels a lot more sort of, in, in this sort of moment, it feels like a lot more sort of freedom with the camera as well. Well, yeah, because it's not fixed. Yeah, I suppose we are sort of. It's. Yeah. That. Temperance. Are you going to pick up the tarot? Where is it? There. Oh, yeah, there it is. Thank you. Temperance, to be balanced, to consume in moderation, or to indulge in excess. Temperance, take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes with temperance comes deferred gratification. So leave it then. Potentially. What are they having for dinner? What are we having for dinner? Are we having burgers, hot dogs, cheesesteak, pizza, pot roast, or fajitas, or biscuits and gravy? Don't share your germs. Handle knives carefully. It's the same art again, isn't it? Yeah. Love it. It does just make me think of the Fallout things. Yeah. Vault, uh, Vault, by, uh, Vault Tech sort of Vault, stuff, yeah. yeah. <sighs> What's in there? Oh, that's a bad place to get stuck. Noted. Okay. Why would you say that though? Like, hint, hint. <laughs> it's like <laughs> foreshadowing much. There's a note on the floor. Ooh, there's bags, but let's not get those just yet. Yep, yeah, let's look at this piece of paper. Nope. There's nothing you can do with the piece of paper. Should we walk around the whole yes, room before let's we. Let's walk uh... around the whole room. There's a bear. <laughs> Okay, good bear statue, like it. To where it chomps his head off. Keep out. Right, that's it. Hang on, wait, 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 wait. Keep out what? Counselors, Counselors only. only. Right. Well, apparently I'm not allowed in there at the moment, so there we go. Oh, who's sitting in here? Oh, it's Dylan. Hello. Yeah, thanks, mate. Okay, really, dude? Locking me out? Okay, in my defense, A, it was oh, Dylan's not Dylan. idea, and two, it was really funny. Oh, was it? Yeah, right. Is that is that <laughs> right? I don't write the rules, man. Okay, whatever. Look, are you gonna help me with the bags or what? Nah, I gotta stay here and wait for Mr. H to return our cell phone. Sorry. Jesus Christ. Okay, and why are the stairs blocked? Well, apparently it's to keep raccoons and other pesky varmints from ransacking the place. Uh, Mr. H's words, not mine. Oh! Boring! <laughs> What's with all these people? Is that you, Dylan? I can only deal with one shit at a time, Jason. <laughs> Too much information. <laughs> okay, so it looks like we're dealing with the bags by ourselves. Yeah. Pick up the fire. I'm going to remember that line next time you bother me. <laughs> I'm having a dump. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I could say it to Squish One when she insists on joining me in there. Oh, yeah, I'm sure she'd appreciate you use the word shit. Yes. Well, yeah, maybe, maybe not think it. Why are these stairs blocked as well? Because there's weird shit going on upstairs that we're not allowed to see, probably. All right. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Mm. In terms of sort of turn it into a positive, go playful. Yeah, why not? Yeah, fuck it. Oh, okay. So now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. Oh. 
Oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at <laughs> all? Knew it. <laughs> Knew it. <laughs> Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. <laughs> so she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we going to make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, no. Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she just got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? <laughs> Which way do we go here? So I was sort of distracted by the sort of like for slow motion. The slow mo going. face, like. <laughs> uh, it's your your character. Your choice. I don't know. Girl, just pick something, man. Just fling. Oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a stupid summer fling. What else did I think was going to happen? Uh, let's see. Uh, love, stability, <sighs> engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation. Empty nest, retirement, grandkid, 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 a uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old <laughs> skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. That kind of in the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Oh, actually, that's just a generic all-men list. Oh, roadhead? What the hell is that? <laughs> Okay. What's that so even mean? Sure Kaylin isn't buying it. <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> Why is everyone picking on this guy? Mm. Uh, okay, so, um... Total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night no, here, no, 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 don't uh, do what it. exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, mm -mm. rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look Are like again? Are we gonna do it? No, no that's gonna arm be bad. That's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. What, like this? Jake. You do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. <sighs> Don't do it. Just <sighs> Don't be the fool. Wait. So I have to choose which one I'm going to do. I feel like still a rotor arm. Yeah, don't the point, break the fuel line. Because at least cause... you can put the rotor arm potentially back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah, don't you're break. not going to like cause potential fire hazard. Let's not thing. create a fire and be a yeah. fool. Path chosen. Hey, come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d Go long. Oh, Why shit. did you do this? Don't know. Boom. Oh, oh. there it is. Oh, Ooh. man, good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh. Freaks. I'm surrounded by freaks. <clears throat> oh, thank God. I mean, I get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> you know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being done to an emergency. Oh, burn. Okay, you guys are all dickheads. I sort of want to get these guys killed now. 
At least I got some. <laughs> yeah. uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hook. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? <laughs> I like this chick. Where is everybody else? <laughs> why, why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah, keep German, Junior. <laughs> right, okay. And again, there's a lot of toxic tension in this yep. group. Yeah, you get Yay! to play! Get there to you play! go! Yay! <laughs> Wonderful. It just sort of, like, spoil it a bit with that whole, like, by the way, we're playing as this character now, it's your turn! <laughs> Okay, yes, I take it back. She reminded me of Jess from the first photo I saw of her initially, mm. but now I'm thinking, maybe not. I like her eyeliner. Mm. I wish I could do mine like that. Maybe I'll start practicing and see if I can do it. I'm sure Squish One will help you. No. <laughs> hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Good guess. You did Good it boy. before it even, You're about to it even come back, off. aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone Kick with the, the key. Door. Shape Kick the door our down. destiny. <laughs> and by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Hmm. I want our bags. All okay. right, well, okay. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. Uh -oh. oh. What the heck? The power. That was the easiest door to open to ever. Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're Emma is think proud it was of you though. Oh, my God, At least you've relax. got a positive sounding like one of those. I haven't yet. All right. Well. Right. So that one's Emma then. Take another look one. around. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. And I get to look in here now. Yeah. So I I could have not gone Aww. in here. Mm-hmm. This was little Izzy's. I wanna play a game! <laughs> That's creepy. <sighs> Let's keep it. We might be able to give it back to someone. Get you back to Izzy. Yeah. Path updated. Mm. Okie dokie. Well, I guess there's little things you could, if you hadn't come in here, obviously all this stuff wouldn't have mm. been possible, but at the same time, like, you may not have this picked place it up. Be in the news. Oh, well. There we go. A scrap from the local newspaper, the North Kill Gazette. A wonderful name. It doesn't look recent. Something about a fire. Was it here at Hackett's Quarry? Freak show goes up in flames. Dozens killed in the fire at travelling show. Right, okay. So that lady that tells us, like, that does the tarot readings, mm. is she dead? Was she, like, was she the one that was in the back of the car with Laura and Max? can't believe I'm actually going to miss all those lumpy loose springs. Okay. And this is another reason why I think I would have not enjoyed the summer camp sort of experience. Just like sort of having to be in like a, effectively a dorm with various mm. other people. You like your own space, basically. I do like my own space, own. yeah. I really like her hair. How like the lights shine yeah. on it. 
I've no idea where I'm going. I'm just gonna. Can I walk any faster? It hasn't said about a way of doing that yet, but it seemed like they were walking faster than in Until Dawn, anyway. And that's a disclaimer. Problem. There are other games than Until Dawn. I know we keep mentioning I know, but Until Dawn. It's just because obviously we know it's it's by the same people, right? It and is it's the same but style. They have made other games. I know, but it's the one that we've done most recently. Oh, I like a little bag. The wings on it. Mm. It's going to be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. Okay. <gasps> what was... There was something at the Throw. window. Oh, was it? No, no, no. There was oh, okay. something in the window. Oh, uh, right. Okay. That's the same thing. I know. You're hoping to get the same thing happen? No, it won't happen again, I don't think. But I want to look in again. Because now I can look. Okay. Right. Been that way then. I really just want to run around these massive areas, like... I want to go faster! Can we go in all of these lodges? I mean, is there, is there any point to checking? That's a lot of lodges, isn't it? Yeah, check this one, see if anything happens. No. Nothing! Okay, let's go and see if we can go on the swing. All the important details, yeah. of course. Can we? Can we bash it? Hey! Yeah, look at that. Oh, was there something? Yeah, there, there is. There? Yeah, yeah, I've yeah, seen yeah. it. Cool. Evidence. Everyone likes a scavenger hunt. And at Hackett's mm -hmm. Quarry, that's no different. There are secrets in these woods, fun secrets that should you uncover them, could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So oh, it's time okay. to dive into the mystery, take pictures, or find pieces of evidence, and you may just prove your innocence. Oh, is that creepy cop gonna taser us? If we quite possibly, are we gonna be in trouble? Don't know. Ouch! Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. Empty vial. What is this? With an unpleasant odor. Oh dear. Is it Dylan's? Ugh. Weird. Wonderful. Jacob and Emma. Forever. For summer. Yeah. Ouch. Hmm. Okay, I have no idea where I'm now meant to be going. This looks like a significant building. Yes, let's go here. What is it with these gameplay recording I don't know, but I wonder if we can switch those off somehow. Because they're getting annoying. Oh, there's somebody over there. Oh, that looks like Emma sat on Oh, okay. Something. Do you think we've done everything here? I reckon that's probably everything here. Yep. It'll take too long to go back over everything, so here we are. She's waiting for you at the uh, the golf cart. Ready to roll? Why is she wearing a padlock? Let's do it. Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. 
confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Um, oh no! <gasps> Eyes on the road, lady. Sorry. Okay, Sorry. so wait for it to Sorry. come up and then do yes. it. Yes. Yes. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. He's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? I have email. <laughs> I'm really going to miss you, Abby. Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Mm, yeah, sure, why not? All right. Yes. Sure. Never know what What's we might find. Mm -hmm. Two months, no technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. <laughs> Which way are you going to go with this? Oh, how'd they even get by for two months without you? I will have you know that I have a very <laughs> loyal and engaged subscriber base. I provide very important and educational lifestyle advice in the form of entertaining and hilarious video monologues. They rely on me. Oh, totally. You're a big deal. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're going to be like really happy or rock. I feel like we were kind of answering that for ourselves. Yeah. Now. Like, the let's not take ourselves too seriously. The island. The not island. Included, right? Is, is that smoke? Oh. It is. Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before. Is he burning? Know, because camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should, we should probably, you know, get back. Oh, yeah. Worried Nick's, you know, gonna leave without you? Well, no, they're probably, like, all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. I like these two. I hope these two survive. Um, hello? You know what's just made me think of is that Laura waking up from her oh, being drunk. Oh shit! It could be okay. No, Carrying this is on you. As Dylan. Yep. It's just still chapter one as well, isn't it? It is. Don't this worry, is a really Jacob, long. I got it's you. Just the intro. I got a full tank of gas. So. The full first full main chapter. Oh, first full chapter. <laughs> <laughs> oh idiot! <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here, anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like. Patchy's balls. You got a battery balls backup patch? thing. What? No. It's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. Uh, you. <laughs> Hello, girls. Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just no one's in any big, these bags up on big rush. The... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of a can deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. No need. That was a little unnecessarily bitchy, wasn't it? It was, yes. Ugh. And that was unnecessarily dramatic as well. 
You gonna nudge? Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Oh, oh so he does you. like her. I think they, they. It's basically Chris and Ash, isn't it? Yeah. From until dawn, they sort of both like each other, but <laughs> scared to make the first move. More comparisons. Sorry. Oh, I really like Abby, though. I didn't like Ashley, but I like Abby. Mm. So hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh, yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little knee party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh. Okay. Podcast. Nice. That's cool. Where did you get about? the signal from? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a quick, about, uh, about me. quick response. You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. <laughs> no, <laughs> what the fuck? Paranormal podcast. Th this episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. <laughs> Are we gonna keep saying yeah, Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Don't you know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? <laughs> oh, can we just please stop <laughs> saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? <laughs> it's just this campfire story for the kids. It's um, they're supposedly an old woman who died in a fire. We know exactly who that back. is, don't we? She haunts the woods, looking for her lost baby boy. Silas. Yeah. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and, and this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son or kill you or <laughs> It's never really been clear. Anyways. Haga Haggett's Corey. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for <laughs> life. <laughs> You gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Or hop to it. Get those butts in gear. Piss off, because I've got other and more Sorry, important Mr. things to H. do. Yeah, deliberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But, you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. He's not the sort of guy I would have expected to be running this place. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. No fair. No. <laughs> cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. Okay. So we're just going to stand in this big circle and not actually do anything, apparently. Oh, and that's me. You're up. Back to me again. There's a lot of character changes I in this we're first chapter. Do an intro to all the characters, so, uh, aren't we? Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh, I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just you know about the whole thing w with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Yeah. Ooh, what are we gonna do? I sort of don't want to go on his bad side, though. That's a toughie.
I don't want to get on his bad side. That's the problem. You, you know full well that if we eavesdrop, he's going to find out. You're playing right now. Oh, but we're doing this as a team. No, no, no. But when not? you're playing the character... Oh, um, you know, I'm going to oh, are you? Oh, okay. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have... Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's a-okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know it, I know it. What's that all about? No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. <sighs> okay. Yeah, of course. Adios. Okay. Sorry, I, I wasn't. I wasn't <laughs> listening. I, I was just like waiting. There we go. He's disappointed. I mean, I, heard, I, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. Saying. We're cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand? Looking for the keys? Uh, no. End of summer. Busy, busy. You know. Anyway. You were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, it's a, uh, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. He's sort of disinterested, isn't mm -hmm. he? Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm thinking that as well. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But do you know how many calls I get from parents? Letter after letter with these terrified no, kids. He's talking about home. this story. Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway can't. It's kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Don't be apologetic. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Got to understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to Kumbaya next time, okay? <laughs> What's that? You don't you know guys Kumbaya? Don't do Kumbaya anymore. <laughs> Good grief! I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Okay, now I feel old if he doesn't yeah. know what Kumbaya is. Fucking hell. <laughs> well, he's a supposedly teenager. Chris, it's what's going on? around now. Yeah. I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Why? Are we going to ask why? Yeah, I want to know why. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. And safety is the first step towards fun. <laughs> Um, right, okay. Just give me a minute. Where in the good goddamn are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see them again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee. Well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? That photo looks Actually, really oddly photoshopped. Actually, could have used the help since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office... Right there. Right where I left uh -huh. it. 
Let's skedaddle. But the van isn't going to work. Yep. And why are there dead <clears throat> deer on that picture? That's really it's odd. a little bit off-putting, isn't it? Okay, so my guess is where this chapter's going to end is the when van they... isn't going to work, Yeah, and they're going to be like, oh, sure we're going to have to stay here for another night. Go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good, because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it, let's go. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> mm. Have we played all the characters now? Not quite. What's the problem? We haven't played uh, as Emma. Dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Oh, yeah, what a shame. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. What, Dude, I'm telling you, all right? It's busted. Well, maybe you're doing Go, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. <laughs> oh, God. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, Come dude, on. chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. I'm Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! At least we didn't cut the fuel, because that would have yeah. gone... Wouldn't yeah, it? well... Possibilities. Okay. Stuff like that to happen. Okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop! Yeah, he's getting think. flustered. Why? What's going on? He knows what's out there. <sighs> okay. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. Hey, Brian, come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning, and we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. You promise me you'll do that? Ah, uh, that ain't gonna happen, is it? Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Why wouldn't that be yeah. hard to do? I mean... Yeah... Sure. <laughs> we'll, we'll stay inside. Kind of freaking us out, dude. Yeah. What is going on? Door. What's this all about? For God's sake, keep the noise down! So, what was that about? He, uh, said to stay inside, that we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Or, or we could do something else. They're totally gonna have a campfire mm -hmm. and drink around a campfire. I say we insistent. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P A R T. Why the fuck not? All right. It seems like the stars have aligned for us. No. Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. <sighs> what could go uh, wrong, eh? Dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He, he was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? He did seem freaked out, didn't mm, he? He did. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. I... No, 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 dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we yeah, the group it. is you getting know, bored you, of Ryan. Excellent. You don't want to disappoint Daddy. Defensive or dismissive? Ah, oh, you know what? Yeah, well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris <laughs> told me. Oh. To do. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. We might be able to save Ryan right, if we uh, right, do stuff like right. this. Or maybe not. Who knows? Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you will get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to charge the phones or something. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Wonderful. Is that a sniper rifle? It looks like a scope, doesn't it? This doesn't bode well. Who the fuck is this? And who the fuck is that? Oh god. Is that the dude from Detroit Become Human? It is, I think. The old dude that Marcus looks after. It is. <laughs> who? Oh my god. goodness. Don't like the look of him. What the fuck? Oh no. I do not like to look at this. What does that sign say? Hunting... What? Hunting what? Hunting season. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 no! This does not bode <laughs> well. I was hoping you'd come back to me. Let's see what you've found. Well, just temperance so far. Mm. Don't know if we missed any temperance. others in that. <laughs> to be balanced. To consume in moderation, or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes, with temperance comes deferred gratification. Bless you. There's more I can show you, if you like. Always. Yeah, Why would sure. we not want to see? Let us see more. I was hoping you'd say that. Oh! Oh, God! You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright. That looked like fireworks of wait. some kind. Mm. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. So, and look out for my car. Don't take fireworks for the party, maybe? Because we'll maybe. get blown up by it, but save them and they might be useful later on. Maybe. Something like that. Yeah. Well, that was chapter one. It feels like that might be a good time to, to bring us on the close. Because, uh, yeah, that's obviously introduced us to the quarry. 
good fun so far. Definitely a lot more sort of this happy feeling. It's bringing yeah, out more so than others the, we've the seen. The first episode of Until <clears throat> well, the first chapter of Until Dawn was like that. It's just getting to know all the characters, isn't it? And it then is, but shit goes down. It was still night time, and mm. that I feel like there was more in Until Dawn that sort of looked a bit like oh god, you know, beforehand. Whereas that was mostly sort of happy, apart from the prologue part, and we've seen Max. You know, have a bit of a grisly death by the looks of it. Yeah, well, there was grisly death. There was creepy cop. There was Hackett getting freaked out because yeah. he obviously knows what happens at night time. Um, and then there's obviously the the lady uh, from the travelling show. Yeah. Looking for her son. Um, but is she strange. dead? It's all very strange. I'm really excited to play more. Um, so hope you enjoyed the first episode, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. See ya. <laughs>